Okay, this is the second part of the study of uh, still life that I'm doing. As you can see, I've put about five or ten minutes of uh, shading in, sketching out with my still life. Now, I want to uh, show how I'm going to use a little bit of eraser to help just give an indication of the guitar strings. I'm not going to do a whole lot of erasing, I just take a little bit. And also the frets that go across. I'm just indicating them. I'm not being specific. And if you want to improve a highlight, say right here, right here, any of these little spots that you think needs a better highlight than just leaving the spot blank, you can go back in with your eraser and touch up a little bit here and there. Um, basically, this is a good five, ten minute sketch. It doesn't have to be perfect. Just want to see what you can pay attention to in your details. Um, don't be real fussy with it. Uh, one of the important things to do with your art is to enjoy it. Now, I might come back later and put more detail in here, but as it is, it can be considered a finished drawing. And I want you all to remember, always put your signature. Mine is VA for Virginia Ann or Virginia Aldridge. And the date. I'm just going to put numerical dates here. And that way, when you come back to it, you can compare it very easily with your later drawings and see how much progress you've been making. Anyway, this is my first lesson. I want you to do this at home. Take pictures of your still life that you've set up and the still life that you've drawn. And when you're happy with it, when you feel like it's as good as it needs to be, it gives enough indication of all the things you're trying to draw, then stop, sign it, take a picture, share it with the class, okay? You have a wonderful Thanksgiving coming up. If you're doing this at a later date, have a good day tomorrow.